Alright, what is going on guys? My name is Chili Cheese Fries. Welcome back to the quarry episode 2. Right where we left off on after the uh, the crazy cop kidnapped us. He kidnapped us. My boyfriend is dead. We're all Hello, alone. Hello my friend. Welcome this person to is the show. Definitely not alive. We are friends, aren't we? You're a zombie. I've waited for you. You're not I've real. Waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting, yes, and terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. You didn't find anything, and so I've nothing to show you. You need to look harder. The no, I missed something. There. If you God don't help me, how can I help you? We're supposed to be friends. You said so yourself. Search harder. Only you can find them. There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Yes. Paths to uncover. On yes, which I know. I can shed light if you let me. Okay. Help me help you. No, I don't want to. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Okay. That's not creepy at all. It's not creepy whatsoever. We're all good here. Are we at camp finally? Back its quarry forever. Is there gonna be a bear jump scaring me out here somewhere? I feel like they're they're gonna do that. Or maybe Jason. Maybe throw Jason in there somewhere. Ladies. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's Quarry forever! <laughs> you know how many shards really, are broken on really last summer camp? It's like a romance hypocalypse. If I could have saved that guy's life. Or if he was uh, uh I'm cynical. I'm gonna I'm be cynical. Yeah, well, I mean, they're just kids. You know, they'll get over it. Uh-huh. Like they'll get over Emma? What? That's not the same thing. Oh, so that's not why you're in a bad mood. I'm not in a bad... Oh, my. <laughs> you know what? We had our last night together, and we're cool. Oh, yeah. So cool that you're never gonna see your special little boo-boo bear ever again. Jesus Christ, you heard that? Oh, come on, dude. The cabin walls are made of band-aids and rat turds. <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Special little boo boo doll. Hi, Emma. Hey. <laughs> okay, this is, um. You've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. The last Say couple of bags. For me. You're a bad person. Yes, that I am. The trunk is full. Or are we leaving? Oh, we're leaving. Wait, are we leaving? I just got here. Oh, I can walk faster. Hey, man, why are you so sad? <clears throat> this is the guy from Jurassic Park. Hey, what are you, uh, what are you listening to? <laughs> Good to know. Great, awesome. Love it. Love that song. It's amazing. No, I wanted to go check the... What? What was that? What was that? Well, let me... No? Okay. Well... I guess, uh... 
I guess we're leaving, so I gotta go grab my bags. Gotta go grab everything. What doesn't kill you? What doesn't you kill stronger. you will make you stronger. Not in the mood sign. Ah, uh, yes. Nothing over here. Can I can I crouch? Can I crouch? Nope. Okay. I'm going upstairs. I I'm going, I'm going. Man, I walk up these stairs so slow. Jesus Christ. Hey. Hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh the door. It's Dylan, come it's on. Broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come wrong on. with this thing? It's just Dylan, closing. please. Whoa. Sorry, bro. Cool. Thanks, guys. So, am I just not getting the bags then? Is that it? Just gotta break through the uh, the window over here. Summer camp since 1953. I guess Quarry Summer Camp was established way back in 1953 and is still going strong today, nearly 70 years later. There's definitely no serial killers lurking in these woods. Skill. <sighs> How? <laughs> Hold on. Why is this guy out of breath going through the window? Was it that Ugh. much of a feat horror. just to get through the window? I hate horror. Cliche. Cliche. Alrighty. Nothing over here. I'm looking, I'm assuming I'm looking for like tarot cards. Is what I'm thinking they're gonna be. Nothing, nothing over here. Man, that's a bad place to get stuck. But I want to go in. <laughs> sort of God, if he says that's a bad place to get stuck. Come on. There's blood, there's literal blood on the floor in here. Let me go in. I wish to go into the weird. Okay, whatever. God, stop staring at my face. Oh. Okay, so I don't. I don't look. I mean, like, they're in. What, whatever, you know what I mean. They're in the weird camera angles, and I just gotta click on them to find them. Temperance to be balanced, to consume in moderation, or to indulge in excess temperance, take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes with temperance comes deferred gratification. Alright, whatever that means. We're too dumb to understand. Why does this kind of remind me of the, uh, of the freaking cabin from Until Dawn? 
Like, it got blown up, I'm pretty sure, at the end of that game, but... Kinda reminds me of that, you know? Alright. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god, you are so mean. <laughs> at least I'm honest. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Uh, I'll go a little bit playful. Oh, okay, so now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just gotta take, Jake. Oh, oh sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme, I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? <laughs> Mischievous? Ah, oh, sexy, huh? How does that camp by far? Okay, sure. Look, it was all settled by the girls in bunk seven, like second day of camp. It goes Ryan, me of course, then Dylan, Emma, Abby. Okay. Nick, and then Mr. H, and... Okay, are you almost finished? Please? Yep, that's it. That's everyone. I didn't even make the list. Uh... So she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we gonna make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she just got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? Mm. Maybe, no, I don't like it. It's just a fling. No, oh, but I mean, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like a stupid summer fling. What else did I think was going to happen? Uh, let's see. Uh, love, stability, engagement, marriage, house, kid, affair, kid, divorce, loneliness, child support, visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise reconciliation, empty nest, retirement, grandkid, 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 a uh, nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. That kind in the ballpark? Oh, shit, I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, here it is. <laughs> Yours just says Roadhead. Bro, that's, Actually, the, that's, that's the life right there. All men list. Huh. Yeah, that's the life right there. <laughs> that is... Okay, All so you can ask sure for as a guy. Old rust bucket's roadworthy. <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. It's all you ever night need. Great outdoors might actually Why kill do you me. need more? Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet, and you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> uh, okay, so um. Total hypothetical, but if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. The Jake, cap and rotor? You do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Guess we'll just have to find out. <sighs> Bro, just disconnect the battery leads. Break the fuel line or steal the rotor arm. I don't know what a rotor arm is, so I'm gonna do a rotor arm. That's the rotor, right yeah. Tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why did they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D don't, Go don't. Long. Oh, dick! Got shit! No! No! <laughs> oh, come on, man! I'm so sorry, Jacob. 
Rough. Hey, maybe uh, you should have put it in airplane mode. <laughs> oh, oh my god, bro. This is cringy. This is some campy stuff right here. Is it cracked? What's up, man? Shut the fuck up. Oh, yeah, no, no doubt, no <laughs> doubt. God damn, my mom's gonna kill me. Your mom? Oh, yeah, to, uh, to tell her I say hi. <laughs> I'll pay to fix it as soon as we're back, man. Well, it's bricked. Crap. Oh, thank God. Huh. Not a peep. Either got zero signal, everybody's already forgotten I exist. Meh. Nah, you know what, whatever, I can go one more day without a phone. Day? The drive's not that far. You know what I mean? Where's everybody else? Why why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't I don't even know how to respond to that. You say Nick, you're way smarter than me and you're a super hot stud who gets any cheeky ones. Okay, yeah. Keep dreaming, Junior. Give me the monsters, man. Stop throwing each other's phones around. Stop with this lovey-dovey bullcrap. Let me go break the car again. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Ah! Okay. <laughs> I never oh know. You're about to get I your phone back, aren't you? I never know what direction Let's to Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito infested backwards dump. Joystick in. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Uh, break in, definitely. I got, okay. I got a computer in there. I got my you phone not get in, in there. Trouble. I won't tell you. Got won't everything go. expensive. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Is that the chick from Modern Family and the... All right, let's do this. On three. Uh, I don't know who that One, is. One, two, three. Ugh. Mm. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Rabies. Rabies on the wall. Oh, there's something over here for me to look at. Aw. This was little Izzy's. There's little Jizzy. Nah. Oh, I, I thought I was going to have a camera in there. I, I bet it has a camera in there. Keep it. Let's get you back to Izzy. Camera, the, sorry, the camera angle is super weird. Why would this place be in the news? Freak show goes up in flames. Scrap from the local newspaper, the North Kill Gazette. It doesn't look recent. Something about a fire. Was it here at Hackett's Quarry? I'd imagine. Why are you just leaving it on the floor? How did you spend, uh, what, presumably all weekend here and not notice the freaking... Half torn newspaper on the Can't floor. Believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. So my wife said about me. No, nothing else. Nothing else over here. Okay, we're done. We outie. My friend is gone. 
There's a crow over there. Can I go into the other rooms? Nope. Okay, I'm gonna imagine I can't do that. I guess... Up here? To this random thing over here? This uh, little outhouse area? The thing with the crow on it? Yes, this is it. My destination. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcements. Did I miss something? There was something blue in that window. Okay, well. I don't know where to go. Maybe the main lodge over there. Maybe I gotta go for a swing. Let's go for a swing. Let's go for a swing. Nope. But I can look at this. Oof. For the summer. Quick time events. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I already saw this. We saw this already. No. Take a moment to consider the following as it will guide you through the various twists and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here are quick time events, or QTEs, which will help you to act at just the right time. Watch your step. Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take your eye off the ball, and it could spell disaster. The path you tread is yours to choose, but that doesn't mean there won't be obstacles along the way. Yeah, yeah. I know. Okay. Ouch. Let's hope Jacob hasn't seen this. An empty vial with an unpleasant odor. Is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. That's a love potion if you know what I mean. Alright. Is this a swing pool? It is. This is just like camp. Let's go swimming. Oh, I'm supposed to go over here. Okay. Well, if I would have had a little bit more guidance here, I wouldn't have been running around to places. What's up? I'm here. I saw some things. Nothing useful. How are you? Ready to roll? Uh, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I always miss him. Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, 
What if he ends up being a dud, kind of like you and Jacob? He's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, I just gotta not out. move it yeah, so sure. fast. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna Who miss you, Who uses email? Oh, hold on! Oh, uh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Alright, we're gonna die, but I'm down. Let's get the content for sure. the YouTube the video. Victory? Let's go. Two months, no technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. My subs need me more. I've been gone for too long. Uh, <laughs> sarcastic. Let's oh, go. How'd they even get by for two months without you? How did they do you know it? That I have a very loyal and engaged subscriber base. I provide Same. very important and educational lifestyle advice in the form of entertaining and hilarious video monologues. They rely on uh, Same oh, totally. about the hilarious video uh, monologues, yeah. but uh, no, not, not. I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're going to be like really else. happy or back. Maybe not so much happy that I'm back. But I mean, who knows? My favorite spot? The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Is, is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should, we should probably, you know, get back. Oh yeah, worried Nick's, you know. Gonna leave without you? Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, see ya. Alrighty, let's go. What? Am I going to sleep? Who is the monster supposed to be? Is it a monster? Or is it a serial killer? Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so... Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No! <sighs> it's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Why are these people so cringy? Just gotta get these bags up onto the... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me, um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because, I mean, it's really not that big she of a deal. She can take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. Cool. <laughs> Nudge. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Thank you. You couldn't even hand it to him. You just throw it on the ground. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh, podcast. Nice, that's cool. What's it about? Uh, 
You know what? You know what? <laughs> Hold on, he's in slow motion. Uh, you were really mean to my friend back there when he was trying to help you grab your bags. So I'm going to tell you to mind your own business. Mind your own goddamn business. I think it's called How to Mind Your Own Business. You should listen to it. <laughs> Ghosts. Ghosts? Yeah, well, all sorts of cryptozoology, really. The, the episode I was listening to was actually about this place. Oh, yeah, yeah, the one that you were talking about to the uh, kids at the campfire. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Yes. What's the so Hag of witch? Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them, ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's <laughs> oh, Quarry. Can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just a campfire Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Hag of Hackett's Quarry. There's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever and, and this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son or kill you or something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways, Haga Haggett's Corey. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. Oh my god, what is the dialogue in this story? Uh, better than yours. Oh yeah, you got a cooler one? Oh no, I wasn't being sarcastic. Uh, I didn't really tell it right. Look, no, 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 seriously, dude, I think it just, it came out wrong. You gotta be careful nah, with this stuff, do. man, this shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Uh, yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. So hop to it. It's David Arquette. Get those butts Woo! in gear. Sorry, Mr. H. You had to liberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to impress the ladies with all his ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? <laughs> the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But, you know... I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. It's gonna make me look for the key, isn't it? Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dillon? Any chance I could get a little charge? I wanna have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Uh, sure, I guess. I mean. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Why would I be annoyed? Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. So he probably has a good reason for not letting me charge my phone. So, uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Yeah. Am I playing? Uh, I'm gonna eavesdrop. What? I'm nosy like that. Because kids are kids. Don't be so much of those. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have. Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's a okay hold on this end. Hold your darn Bobby horses. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know it. I know it. No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Try staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. So, probably, they probably know what's going Sorry, on at I, the camp. I wasn't, I wasn't listening. I, I was just, like, 
waiting. Like I mean, I heard. Uh, I mean, I was. I didn't hear what you were. Saying. We're cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry, I pushed you out like that. So yeah, so they know what's going on at the camp. They're trying to get rid of the kids before anything bad happens. And because that guy messed with the car, oh, we're not gonna get out in time. Looking for the keys. Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. It was just the whole animation school thing. What you thought I should do? Right. Y you know, listen, uh, whether or not I should like leave my sister with my grandparents since I'd have to live on campus. You know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, right? Dang it. Mm, I'm, I'd be frustrated. Yeah, this I'm just is trying just to talk to him. Important to me. You know what's important to me, Ryan? Trying to run a successful summer camp. I'm still trying to make up for the losses from last year. Uh... Terrified kids are bad for business. That's Phone not calls my problem. I get from scandalized parents, nightmares, thumb sucking, bedwetting. Think about that the next time you're flipping some yarn about the, uh, the. The, the Hagger Hackett's. Just think next time, champ. Use the old skull muscle. I'm not apologizing for that. That's not my fault. <laughs> it was just a fun story that weirdo kid told me last month. Hey, there's no weirdo here. At Hackett's Quarry, everyone's their own brand of cool. You cancelers gotta be the responsible ones. Keep the kids happy. Keep the kids oh, safe. Oh, we're counselors? So knock it off. Yeah, of course. I mean, we are. Wait, so are we... Are we prepping for kids to come to camp? I thought we Seriously, were the Chris, kids at camp. What's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Uh, why? Why does it matter? Why? It's getting dark, Ryan, and it's not safe to drive in the dark. And safety is the first step towards fun. That's the saying. That's how it goes. Just give me a minute. Oh, boy. Why are you Where lying to me, goddamn sir? Good goddamn, are they? Can David Arquette get stabbed but not die? Just like he does in the movie. Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off-season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. Sure. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left him. Uh -huh. Let's skedaddle. Boy, if you just close the door on me, I'm gonna just stay in the office. This is my office now. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. All right. Let's go. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. You noob? What is this dialogue? I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. What's the problem? Ugh, oh, dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. 
All right, let me it's try. It's almost like someone messed with the cap and rotor. What? Dude, I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing Go, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Shit. It's not hard Come to right. turn dude, a chill. key, maybe press chill, on the gas dude. pedal. Chill, dude. Damn it! I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! What if I had the option to not mess with the car? Would the story just okay. end here? Okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. <laughs> okay. <laughs> me trying to Damn. fix my car right there. <laughs> You're right, you're right, yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. Ah, yes, I aced it. I just gotta wait for them to give me a direction. Hey, bro. It's not really a quick time Come event. It's like sec. a slow motion, one minute timed event. I was going way too fast for it previously. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. Got it. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Why wouldn't we just go in your car? That? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll do it. Yeah, sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. Lock the doors. And for God's sake, we... keep the noise down. Why can't we just go with you? Why does it matter what car we go in? All right, so, so we're stuck. We're stuck at camp for one more day. What was that about? He uh, said to stay inside. That we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. Or. Or we could do something else. What are you talking about, man? What are you what talking about? What are you talking about? No Mr. Hackett, no screaming kids. Just a bunch of grown-ass adults ready to cut loose and get down with their animal side. Oh, hell yeah! P Bro, what are you talking about? You don't have a girlfriend. T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett like seems her pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. Dude, he was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um... Like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? <laughs> mm. uh, 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 he did seem a little freaked out. I don't I know don't why. I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, dude, he won't we even don't have know. A choice. No, 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 dude, dude, it's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you, uh, you don't want to disappoint Daddy. Uh, whatever, man. Whatever, man. It's gonna be fine, man. Trust me. It's gonna be chill. All right, all right, all right. Hackatiers. 
party planning. Is that going to mean they want to uh, kill him okay. later on? First things first. Nick and Abby, you go get some firewood. Uh, Emma and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just, I don't know, figure out how to charge the phones for something. All right, let's do this. We're stuck at camp. One more night. That's a sniper. Holy cow. Someone's about to get sniped. Go for the triple. Oh, have we been just been standing outside this whole time? Oh, it's way darker than. What the heck? That guy's all bloody. Covering ourselves with blood here. Is this part of the ritual to stay away from the monster? <laughs> what happened to that sign? What just happened? It's hunting season. Are they gonna hunt some kids? I was I hoping got some. you'd come back to me. Let's see what you've found. Temperance. <laughs> to be balanced. To consume in moderation. Or to indulge in excess. Temperance. Take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes... With temperance comes deferred gratification. There's more I can show you, if you like. Sure. Uh, let's see more. Let's see more. You'd say that. Not the crystal ball. Not the crystal ball. Oh, oh god. You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. Okay, so... Yeah, so... At some point, they're, they're gonna pick up a box and it's gonna explode in my face. And that's gonna happen. That's gonna happen to me. All right, that's chapter two. Oh, so there's there's chapters here. Uh, I think I'm gonna cut it off there, guys. That was like uh, one big filler episode. A lot of backstory, lots of character development, no action, nothing yet. But uh, come uh, next episode, whenever I get to that. We should get to the mean potatoes of this. Um, I was recording in like 30 minute episodes, but if they're going to divide it into chapters, then probably I'll just have to go to hour long episodes because that was, that was a bit of a jump and that was all just one chapter. And I don't know how long these are if they're divided, especially for that. So I will see you guys next time. Uh, hope you liked the video and uh, yeah, enjoy.